Hi, my name is JP Novak with Hill Country Eco Power. We're here to show you how to make a clean splice of your solar PV racking equipment. Here with Eric Johnson. So the first thing we're trying to do here is combine two sets of rails into one so that we have a lengthy run here to meet our needs on a column. Bring the two together. These are Shuko rails. They've, and this right here is the mechanical attachment. Apply two of the set screws in. This mechanical attachment is going to hold it together. Um, there are some engineering criteria that you want to follow when making a splice. Uh, try to keep your splice as close to your attachment point as possible. Uh, it helps support it. What Eric's doing right here is applying a, an electrical bond or an electrical splice between these two rails. And the reason why we're doing this is because then it creates one electrically solid piece of equipment. And we can bond this entire piece of rail at one point because we've got a splice bonded here. That's a weep clip. It replaces a conventionally used star washer. And when he tightens that down, the four teeth on that weep clip are going to bite in to the extruded aluminum rail, creating that electrical bond. Everything's tightened down. Perfect. So that is how you make a structural and electrical splice of a solar PV racking rail. And thanks so much. My name is JP here with Eric. We're Hill Country Eco Power.